guys, we are at Slab City and we're looking for a spot. If you take a look over to your right here, we got stuck. So our plan is to dig down a little bit and it, the ground's harder over here. We've got a little sinkhole, I think, but we're gonna cut some wood down and kind of make a little path to get out of here. But besides that, I mean, we got a pretty secluded, nice location back here. We just went on a wrong curve and underestimated our weight a bit. <laughs> <laughs> this, anyways, my this buddy, much my buddy's always on the on the other side there um, digging out, so it's nice to have another help pair of hands. But uh, I'm not worried. We got a lot of water. We got our electricity. We got our food. We'll get out of here. So yeah. See, See you when we everyone. get everyone. We are in Slab City here, of course. Uh, in the last clip, you would have known that we got stuck driving too far into the desert there. Um, there's nobody out here, so we just kind of decided to kind of hang out out here. Um, don't want to disturb anybody or run into any problems. Just want to experience the last free place in America, so they say. But yeah, we're going to put a fire together just kind of gathering wood here um, buddy we had with is um, walking around the desert he might uh, go over to the what's the thing called the range, the range. Um, it's Thursday night so they got stuff going on there I guess and Chris and I and the dogs are gonna hang out here and just kind of have a fire cook up some food all right everyone Sun's getting low on the horizon, and we're getting ready to boil some water on the Coleman propane stove. I think we're just gonna have some. Well, I'm gonna have some ramen. I'm not sure what Kristen's gonna Mac cook up. Cheese. Mac and cheese. But as Mike from Living Free said, we sure got a nice sunset starting to form here. And it's making me want to get my camera out. I just wish I had a better vantage point to get it all into frame. But over here we have our foldable table that's really compact and it works really nice. You can fit four people on there. And it's got enough room to put your food on there or computer or what else, whatever else you need to. Getting wood processed still. Probably got about another, I don't know, 15 minutes, if that, before the sun sets completely. So, yeah, we're gonna just kind of sit around the fire after we eat tonight. Maybe show you guys a few shots of the fire. And, yeah, see you tomorrow. <laughs> 